back with second season of Mashley. Ooh, Saitama at Hogwarts. That's right. We're going to see more cream puff jokes, more ridiculousness of Mash's brute strength. And I believe this is getting into the divine visionary, some kind of arc, right? Let's begin today's reaction. Ooh. I love the soundtrack, though. Yes. This guy was in the trailer. So the Magical Bureau is like higher than the Divine Visionary, right? It's like pretty much the police force. So right, this is Rain, Rain and something? Our like dorm mate's older brother. Right, Rain Ayamas. Right. This guy is more important, right? So the the Magia Lupus was pretty much just like, doesn't really matter. This dude and their group that escape actually matters. The secret's out? Yeah. Whose voice actor is this from the anime that we're watching right now? Is this Isekai Instant Death voice actor too? Isn't it? Kill him. Kill him. Wait, are our friends actually so dumb that they still believe that he can't use magic? Wait, wait, what was she? No, 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 they're just playing defense for us. We just. <laughs> the three dummy trio just had the most stupid solution, but it works because this show is just for memes, anyways. Oh? Who the fuck is Pompadour here? <laughs> Who is this mob character? I can't use it. Prove it. <laughs> it's muscle magic, man. This is the practice we did? Bro, what is that pompadour? It looks like a dick on his head. A criminal? But Dumbledore already knows that we can't use magic, right? He's gonna vouch for us. Make fun of our friend. Yo, we did a lot of things for Finn. Plus, Finn's older brother is a divine visioner. We haven't seen Finn really use magic yet. In season one, he's been pretty much just like our friend that doesn't do anything, right? That we have to save. But if you make fun of Mash, I think he might get angry. <laughs> oh, stepping up? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Was this magical with gravity magic? When did we see this? It's been so long. Maybe we have seen this magic, I just forgot, but okay. <laughs> no, the other guy? No, that's a totally different dude has gravity magic, right? <laughs> yeah, no, it's our fucking Cisco. Yeah, Lance is the one with the brother man. Sorry, it's been so long since this first season. I gotta fucking... I gotta figure out, I gotta remember what everyone's powers are. No. Yes, his complex. <laughs> double liner, double liner. It's very strong. So we still haven't seen, you know, Finn's magic yet. <laughs> Did he just spit on him? <laughs> That's still fucked up. That's like forehead, right? Doesn't he like cover some shit? How's Dot, how's he gonna eat? Please feed him. Bro, Lance, I swear to God, just straight up, like, he puts on the apron and does all the house husband shit so well. Creepy. But I bet they're like friends now and they'll be chill, right? They're pretty chill now. Manabu? Horikita Manabu? Anos' his voice actor? I never realized! <laughs> yeah, it's him! This is so weird hearing his voice again. <laughs> yes, student council president. Right, his name is Lord Abel. And we got fanboy Evil Eye. <laughs> Does he fold to dot? Does it... <laughs> so he has no riz against girls, okay. Females. <laughs> Abyss calls girls females. That's how little experience... So he's just like... <laughs> 
borderline insult females. She constantly makes like marrying jokes to him, right? Oh, I want to get married to you. <laughs> that fell on the ground. But you can't let Cream Puff fall on the ground. So with sheer suction power, he saves it. That shouldn't be possible, but you know, that's his magic. Muscle magic. The other people that showed up at the end? Oh, it's card game. Dauto, BS, bullshit. What is this? This is so chaotic. This is so fucking chaotic. See, in Harry Potter, they have like owls that send letters too. By the death row. Yeah, that's their name. Innocent Zero. Why is Dot on the ground right now? <laughs> okay. I don't think Mash is listening. He never listens during the scenes. Okay. <laughs> it's so serious just to get a board game. Third line through artificial. Okay, this is actually important because people are born with the lines, right? You're either one line that's kind of like mid, you're born with two lines. Sometimes you can be like born with one line, but you can be like dot where it's like secret genetic shit where it's actually super OP as like the double liners. And then the third line is artificial from Innocent Zero. It can be. Okay. Genuine triple liner. So Abel is not a genuine, so they're even stronger. Hmm. I don't think he listens. He finished that entire plate of cream puffs. Bro is straight up not listening. That was a hype scene. This fight, the fight between him and uh, Mash is probably better than Abel in my opinion. <laughs> Bro didn't listen at all. He's like, what did you say? Can you repeat yourself? What? Okay. <laughs> Maybe he did listen. Who knows? Oh, it's fucking Pompadour head again. Yeah, because we are buddies. Ooh, someone's showing up in behind. Oh, I get the fuck out of my face. Get out of here, Pompadour! See, he was all just talk. We'll probably never see him again. Female, female, awa, 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 awa. That owl just broke her fucking window. That owl just did what Mash does, just opens the door by breaking it. <laughs> All those owls just break more windows. Uh oh. No, Dumbledore can vouch. This is bullshit. God? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, God. Okay, where are we going with this? Right, if you don't have magic, you're pretty much like, you get called. You, you, you get killed if you don't have magic, don't you? Hmm. Interesting. Wait! Who is this guy? He's the Divine Visionary we saw from the trailer. This voice acting though, who is a recent character we've seen from uh, the enemies we're watching, guys? Skuna? Oh, it is Skuna's voice that Oh, shit. This guy seems to be super important for the trailer. Rio Grunt, Magic Security Forces Captain Delight Kane, because each Divine Visionary has some kind of like something Kane, right? Because Reina is like um, Sword Kane. So this guy's Light Kane, Light Magic? <laughs> Alright, fuck it. Alright, fuck it. Ignore it. Oh, hi. Mm. 
Where are you getting with this? Okay. This guy's philosophy is very interesting. Huh. Candle. Just fucking... Just fucking do a little... And with the wind friction to the fucking top of the candle, it'll cause... I don't know, friction, and then fire will happen. Yeah, use your muscle magic. Or throw something to, like, rub the top of the candle to cause, like, friction. Damn. We can do it, though. It's easy. What if he just throws the fucking wand? You throw the fucking wand to graze the top of the candle thing to light it on fire. Muscle magic, you'll see. Or maybe he'll just go like this, right? Just... They call him Sir Ryo. Wait, is he gonna do this? Wait! <laughs> this is his... Ma I mean, it's muscle magic. We're gonna fucking start the fucking flames like this. Okay. Impossible. And then, what the fuck kind of fire is this? I mean, hey, we did it, right? We proved it, so you can't talk shit to us anymore. Yeah. Easy. Smile. This guy's very interesting because the way he was talking is like, it doesn't really matter who's the one talking. It's about the person that's talking. It's like, if you can just do it, just show me, right? So he doesn't care. It doesn't matter if he doesn't have magic or not. He just wants to see, are you legit? And he just proved you are. So Mr. Sir Rio, he probably has his eyes set on MASH now, huh? Mmm, he likes it. Nice guy. Yeah. Nice guy. More divine visionaries? They're kind of on our side, even the way that guy was talking. Well, that guy's a summon. That's another familiar voice actor, girl. I'm still looking for a genuine three-liner. Gara of the Sand! Sabaku! But this isn't Naruto. Alright, there's a sand user here? Because Light Guy said it's okay. More divine visionaries. Shit. Who is Mr. Wahlberg? Was he one of the top police chiefs that was helping us out? I forget. Who's Mr. Wahlberg again? No, Wahlberg is the Dumbledore. No, no, no. Wahlberg is Dumbledore. Yeah, you got Renatus Revolve. Magical Cemetery Administration. The Immortal? Immortal Kane? Because something Kane is the Divine Visionary, like their powers, right? So I'm going to assume the guy that atta attacked this is a Sand Kane, but this guy is literally Immortal? Ice Kane. Yeah. Suraha. Okay. Another fanboy, Kaldo Gehenna. Magic talent admin, the flame king. So it's like fire magic. I wonder if him and Dot will have a battle. No triple line is so far, but this guy has like a summon. The dragon cane. Familiar voice actor, this guy. Sophina Brivia. Forbidden magical text I mean, The knowledge came. I like her a lot. Alright, I think I like the girl a lot. She's like forbidden magic. Sophina. Man, this guy's such a boomer. Orter Maddle, the desert king. So basically Gara. But again, still two lines unless if he lifts the hair up and there's an extra line. <laughs> Bro is power tripping so hard, but he's kinda right. The divine visionaries do stand above everyone else. Bro, bro, relax! Walbrook said it's okay! Hmm. 
What? Uh, Who? Isn't that Baldi that we were just talking to? But is he being possessed by someone right now? Right? That's Baldi, but he's... Innocent Zero, okay, possess Baldi. When did he get in here? Why is he so important? Because Mash is technically an orphan, right? Even though his last name is Burn Dead, he just showed up out of nowhere and our dad just like picked him up. So we don't really know how Mash is created. Is he a fucking test tube baby from Innocent Zero? I don't know. I'm my cream puffs possession. Alright, cool. I don't care. I, I honestly don't care if Baldi dies. Like, who are you? Yeah, who is this guy? He, he let the divine visionaries in. So basically, parasite. Parasite, okay. So you can't even try to peel it off so they go to you. Hmm. I don't think they really give a fuck though. Oh, wow. oh that was fast! Light magic! Light magic! I, the strongest and the hottest guy! <laughs> <laughs> okay, I really like this guy. I actually really enjoy this flashy light guy. He's the most chill so far, right? He's pretty reasonable, right? He played defense for us. He's like, all right, if you can light this candle, I don't care really how you do it. You're legit. He did it. And he's like, ooh, cool guy. And now he's like, I, right, the strongest and hottest guy. This is probably true. He probably is the strongest, right? If he is the leader of the fucking oh, Divine Visionary. Oh, oh. That was way too fast! <laughs> but it's gonna go to you now! Just... No, you're a mob character, we're not listening. Just puke it out? You know, like those clowns with those inflatable balloons and you fucking make it. I think this is supposed to be a poodle. I think this is supposed to be a fucking dog. Bro just swallowed the parasite. This fucking somehow is with his, did he do it with his tongue? I don't fucking know. How? It's a dog balloon. Yeah. Okay. That was a bureau officer, by the way. Yeah. Like the cherry stem with their tongue. What that? Tongue do, man. Jesus. It's called uh, tongue magic. Yeah, tongue magic. Yeah. Again, bureau magic. Did you see that? He got introduced twice there. <laughs> Just for a second. He's like bureau magic officer admin or some shit. <laughs> oh, that looks like he died. Yeah, he solved it all by himself. Hmm, I bet he's super interested, right? Flawless. Ho -ho. Sand guy, relax! The sand guy just wants to fight! Fuck the rules! I fucking hate people who are so fucking stuck in the ways of tradition that was rules set by a bunch of fucking boomers through corrupt means back in the fucking day that shouldn't apply now. They stick to traditions because they can't fucking think outside the box. It's this dude. He's fucking annoying. He's a traditionalist, man. Fuck the rules! You know what they say? Rules are meant to be broken. Yeah, who's gonna kill me? You? Fuck you. Did he just escape? You can't just throw a child tantrum here, though. <laughs> so did he just plant himself here? <laughs> did he just plant his legs here saying, I'm not gonna go? <laughs> what are you gonna do about it? Move me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, sand magic incoming. Ooh. Ooh. Sand magic so fast. Yo, look how close that guy! Look at that side eye. He was ready to dodge at an instant, right? I bet he would have done something like, I don't know, just like that little fucking air blow and the sand would have gone away. He was perfectly fine, but the light cane stopped it in time. Sheesh! Look at him! Oh, he doesn't respect him. 
Fuck the rules. This guy is such a fucking government dog. Rainus! Rainus! Our friend's big bro. Oh. Oh, the soundtrack. With Dumbledore. Shit. Yeah. This is fucking hype. The early part was a little bit slow and boring to get us recap, but the Divine Visionary showing up? God damn, this is looking good. And that's the episode, guys. Damn. It's been a while. I forgot some characters named their powers, but we're back at it. The initial half was a little bit slow, right? But it's just to kind of recap on what's going on. What is this world? Remember these characters? This is what's going on with the plot right now. People are kind of aware that magic, magic doesn't exist to the point that divine visionaries are actually getting involved. These people are supposed to be... You remember, every time our school produces a divine visionary, they then go to the magic burrow and then they're, they're like the leader of some kind of division, right? Everybody has their own di different division. I think this girl right here is like the forbidden magic or some shit. Pretty cool. The, these power scale the world building is like expanding. It's getting very interesting. Innocent Zero is trying to get Mash. Why? I don't know. It's probably because Mash is maybe like a test tube baby from there because he's technically an orphan, right? I like the light guy. Skuna's voice actor. Amazing. But then this fucking sand dude, he's fucking pissing me off. This guy's being the main antagonist right now. But technically, we should be at, you know, we should all be in the same team. So we'll find out what's going to happen in the next episode. But hey, if you're still here, if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for more content. And until next time, take care.